Hello, today I'm here with a new video and today I am here with my f March favorites of 2019 and I am like, how can it soon be April? I don't know. So today I'm going to show you my favorites and this is a pretty short video as normal when it comes to my favorite videos. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to start. I don't have as so many favorites because every month when I'm like, okay, I'm going to take I take out all my favorites. I'm like, what have I loved during this month? And I also want to keep these videos pretty short. So I will just start and I have two skincare products that I will start with. And I have found a new holy grail or maybe two new holy grails. I think maybe both of these are my holy grails. And yes, I know I shouldn't buy skincare because I am on a low buy, but this was something that I needed and didn't have. And this is from Pixi. It's their Hydrating Milky Mist. You can see how much I have used this. I love this spray. The only thing, I don't know if mine is a little bit broken because the spray, it can only spray like, like short spritz. And I have a glow mist from Pixi and it can spray like long mists. So I don't know, but I love this so much. My skin has been so freaking dry. And this, it helps. It, it helped like for, from the start. So I use this, you should use it on nighttime. I use this every morning and I love this. I going to buy this so many times in the future i love this so so much the other thing is a jade roller and this is kicks own jade roller and kicks is the swedish big makeup store and this is a jade roller like the jade stone and i use this morning and night and I take my serum and then I take this on my face and it feels so good and the serum really sinks into the skin so freaking good I love this as well this is also a new holy grail for me I don't know if it works but it feels good and my skin feels more moisturized and then we can go into skincare and I have two more like base products the first one is Revolutions Conceal and Correct. This is the white one. C O C zero. Um, it's called white, and I use this a little on my chin, a little bit on my nose, and in my forehead just to highlight. And you understand how pale I am when I'm highlighting with something white, and it doesn't look off. So I love this one. Um, I love the formula and I love to find something that I actually can highlight with because like all the concealers are too light for me. So I love it. Too light for me, too dark for me to highlight. So love this one. Not as a concealer but as a highlight. And then the other one, I, f I think we can call this a base product, is a new thing from Linda Holberg and this is the H2O glow mist and as you know I love Linda Holberg Linda Hallberg I never know if I'm going to say it in English or Swedish but Linda Hallberg they came out with a glow mist and I have wished for a mist from them and this is like a two part mist so this is very hydrating so you shake this and they spray it and I love it it gives an amazing glow the only thing I don't like it's the bottle it's so small but I really like this it's a super good product and then I have found a new mascara favorite and this is from NYX it's worth worth the hype I liked it from the start but then I think I thought I was only getting length from it but now I have used it a couple of weeks and I think it's dried down a little bit I don't know some mascaras just turns better and better with time but now I also got some volume and it's so easy to I, I just love it maybe this is my new favorite I don't know I loved my mascara head before this but this one it's worth the hype 
for me it's worth the hype and I think this is also vegan I am not sure but I think so but it's a really really good mascara and then I have two lipsticks and these are so different from each other one is NYX liquid suede this is an OG for me in soft spoken and this is like a dark nude for me it looks like this I love this and yes I have swatches I love this one it works if you have makeup and it works if you don't have any other makeup so I love it the other one is unicorn blood from Jeffree Star and when I first bought this one I was like I can never go out with this because it is too dark for me it looks like this but I love it I had it in, I think it was my free looks one palette with Juva's Place. I had it in my first look and you also seem to love this lipstick and I do too. It's such a cool color. It looks pretty brown in the tube but it's not that brown on the lips. I just, it's an awesome color. And the last favorite for March is an eyeshadow palette and it is of course the Tri Palette from Juvia's Place. I love this so much. I have done three looks one palette, a first impression and also get ready with me. Um, I can leave up here and down in the description. It looks like this. This is an amazing palette and I think it's pretty unique. Like this shade, I have nothing like this. So this has been a big favorite and I want to play with it like all the time but I understand that I can't just use one palette but this is such a good palette. And that was actually all of my favorites for March. I really hope you liked this video and if you have any special favorites please let me know. It's always fun to hear what you have loved and I hope I will see you in the next one. Bye!